Hi, this is Patty Jackson with the live version of the 411. Let's talk Fantasia. The divorce trial between Antoine Cook, her married boyfriend, and his wife is going on. Well, Tasia is being sued. She had to go to the stand and admit that they started having sex immediately. She knew he was married and she had an abortion. Hmm. Queen of Soul Aretha Franklin opens up with a new issue of Jet Magazine. This is the one with President Barack Obama on the cover. Now, Aretha has been sick, and she admits that she's under doctor's care. They're trying to find out what's wrong, but she's not been feeling well. Also, singer Smokey Robinson, he's been ill. He had to cancel some important dates in Chicago. And Don Cornelius, the founder of Soul Train, he's also been battling health issues. Speaking of Soul Train, it's happening Sunday, November 28th. you got to be there on the BET and Eccentric Networks. Tara Tower, Taraji P. Henson are hosting. They look fabulous on the new issue of Jet Magazine. Some of the highlights include R. Kelly, who's opening the show, and Ron Isley and Anita Baker are going to be the big honorees. Tyler Perry's Medea's Big Happy Family, the DVD stage play, is out on DVD, so make sure you pick it up. Wesley Snipes, where is he? He's headed to jail, but check this out. He's not there yet. He's hiding out because they're waiting for him to surrender. Now, you know what's going to happen. They're going to have to drag him out. They're going to have to drag him to that federal prison. Deshaun Snow, I always liked her. First season, Real Housewives of Atlanta. They got rid of her. They saw she was too nice. She was too boring. But boy, how her life has changed. She was married to basketball player Eric Snow. He used to play for the Sixers. Well, he dumped her for another woman, had a baby with the other woman. But don't cry for Deshaun. She got millions. She got millions out of that divorce. For settlement. And now, with her millions, her three kids, her mother, and her sisters, she's headed back to reality TV. She's lost some weight, she's gotten it together, and now she's ready to show the new side of her life. Montana Fishburne, we thought Lawrence Fishburne's daughter was done with the porn thing. When you think about the top stories of the year, Montana Fishburne is there. She went to rehab for anger management issues, but now she's back. She says she's going to do more porn, and check this out. Because I have to figure out like a nice way to put it. She's going to get bigger boobs and she's going to get her private parts tightened. I don't know any other way to say it. But I guess it's going to be like snatch. Let's continue on with the other story. Jamie Foxx is coming back December the 1st with a new CD. Look for him a lot on the big screen next year. Jennifer Aniston in the movie Horrible Bosses. And he's teaming up with Martin Lawrence. They're going to do their Shanae and Wanda characters in the movie Skank Robbers. I got some Desperate Housewives news. Okay, Eva Longoria. We know that she and Tony Parker are divorcing. She found the text messages. He just signed a $50 million contract. You do the math. I hear a couple of stars could be leaving Desperate Housewives in the form of Terry Hatcher and Felicity Huffman. Apparently after next season they want to be out. Vanessa Williams, she's looking hot, very sexy, and incredible. She has nothing but a coat on on the new issue of Ebony Magazine. This is where we give you the 411, the live version, right here at WDASFM.com.